second day of exploring hard to find. Okay, come this way. Huh? So that's the birdie trail up there. Yeah. Too many bird watchers. There's a trail or something there. Yeah, but I want to take the trail from there. Oh, okay. That trail. Walk across the bridge. Yeah. Drought. No water. Oh God, it's not hot. Yeah. Seventy right now. Last night, when I woke up, it was 21 degrees. 70 is not this bad. It's supposed to be warm now, coming up. Heat wave coming. Oh, I don't like that. Love me these trees. Oh, <laughs> and we ended up where you said first time. Yeah. <laughs> it curves. That's why I thought, okay, I'll go this way. I don't care. I didn't see that. It didn't matter to me. We're heading in that direction one way or the other. Yeah. Oh, here. Yep. Well, I wanted to go over the bridge. We went over the bridge. Yes, Oscars. You hear them, but you cannot see them. Nope. Yeah. Let's check it out. This must be the trail. Yeah, this. This is the trail, and right. we're we, we, two? Two, number two, we are right here. And if we take, uh, we'll take this one straight ahead to four, but yeah. I kind of wanted the other one, but well, we can take that way. We can go to three and do like this. How do you want? Do you want to do this? I don't care. So we're at two here. Yeah. And we go that way. Yeah. So three should be to the right somewhere. Yeah. I would like that. Hitchhikers. Spread, stop. Spread the invasive species. This boot. To use that boot. Oh, brush. Oh, oh two brush. Is that way, then, right? Two, two. Two, yeah, going towards two is that way. Okay, gotcha. All right. I but uh, we go this way and then we go to three. Right. So we have to use the uh, the brush, but we don't have to use the brush because uh, we didn't uh, uh, we uh, didn't go in another trail. No. All right. Here's an Oscar up there. Uh, oh, for my our viewers, an Oscar, it's a robin. We had years ago for uh, we found a baby bird, no feathers, and uh, half dead. We brought him back to life and ended up being a robin. He had an injured leg. He didn't know how to fly. I taught him how to fly, but even so, couldn't be released. 
and uh, he stayed with us for 10 years and one day he died after 10 name. years and his name was Oscar Oscar Robin Thompson yeah and he didn't know he was a bird at lunchtime he refused to drink from a, uh, the bird dish he wanted his glass of apple juice on the table, his own plate on the table, to eat with us. Yeah. He had no idea. And once I had to leave for months to Lansing, and he lost his feathers out of stress because I was gone. When I came back, he was so happy. Oh, yeah. He had his own bedroom. He was getting upset when he was taking his bath, and if you're looking at him, he would get really upset. <laughs> He'd stop. He would stop and come to attack you. Yep. He wanted privacy. Yep. So that's why every time we see a robin, a robin we say Oscar. one way <laughs> as if two hikers cannot pass by that's ridiculous that's some side trail i don't even really know uh that's uh, uh, the dividing point with this we go to three that we'd go to two i don't know I didn't uh, take a picture of the map. See? <clears throat> oh. Okay, Oscar. Oh, remember when Oscar started imitating the cats? Yeah. Meowing? Yeah, until one of the cats jumped on his cage. Yeah. And after that, he didn't want nothing else to do with him. Yeah. Miss Kitty, remember? Yeah, she had an IV on her paw, and even so, jumped on his cage. Yeah, acted like he wasn't there, walked by, and all of a sudden she... Pounced. Pounced and was hanging on the cage and he was freaking out. Okay. Too bad that I cannot zoom how he was walking ahead of us. Okay. Oh, Three we got that to, way. Yeah. We got to point two. Yeah. That was just a side trail. Yeah. It wasn't marked. Yeah. <clears throat> That's why it said one way. You can just keep going that way. I'm going to hit the map now. Uh. Oof. I have it on paper, this one. Yeah, okay, it will. The map? Yes, thank you. I think I swallowed a, a fly. Oh. A tiny one. Little protein. Little protein, yeah. <sighs> so a mint after the meal is perfect. <laughs> While we were on the trail, I received a phone call. A friend of mine found a horse, a lost horse. Finally, the animal control officer came immediately 
Another friend of mine came with a horse trailer. Horse trailer. I'm trying not to choke in the candy with the horse trailer, but they couldn't put the horse in the trailer. So, now there are a few miles from a little D to Karen's house. <laughs> At least 10 miles, I think. <laughs> and now the animal control officer has to walk not even ride the horse. Walk the horse to my friend's house for safekeeping until they find the owner. So, these are the news. In fact, all my friends I met, they all in one way, since I moved in the Northern Michigan, they are one way or another connected with rescuing animals. Sorry. Yeah. So. Oh, this is another trail. That's an offshoot. See the arrow? Yeah. That's an offshoot trail. Like we got caught on that one time. We have miles and miles of trails here. Mm -hmm. We can even put the tent overnight and okay. yeah, probably will take us to do all the trails, maybe three, four days, Maybe. but because we are living so close, we can come every day and do another trail before the big heat starts. When yep. we start getting into 80s and 90s, we don't like it. No. We put the air conditioner on and we go on total gym. Yep. Because humidity is killing us. It would be only 80 or 90, but not really humid, probably would be okay. But being a peninsula, Michigan being a peninsula, and having so many lakes around, it's extremely humid. It gets there. Yeah. The land of four seasons. Yeah. <laughs> and we have a saying in Michigan, if you don't like the weather in Michigan, wait, wait five minutes, it will change. Lot, so yeah, usually it's the weather, it's unpredictable. Everything can try, change really fast. Here it is. No hunting, no trapping. State Historical Park, DNR. And Right here, across, this is a DNR road, open to hunting, Parks Division. Ha! Talking about contradictory, misleading information. And again, no hunting, no trapping. Now the trail converged into the DNR road. Probably across the street you can you can hunt because in this side you cannot hunt. Okay. Yeah. In this side of the road you can hunt, on the other side you can't. It's like the border for hunting.
Is yes, the this way goes the trail. So here okay. again we go on the trail. Just for a short while they went on the same route. A little change of scenery in our trail now not so many hardwoods i hope i can see whoever makes that noise a bird i don't see it anyway a change of scenery here there are more pines no so much hardwoods and the trail it's uh, waving up and down in a roller coaster not exactly virginia roller coaster but can be tiring at times i think we are four miles onto the trail now we are going through a forest of uh, maybe pines Many times I came on this trail and I never ever met another soul on the trail, this part of the trail. The other one, the paved one, which we went the other day, we met people. But on this one, we, I never met any people. Around here used to be an excellent view of the hills but now it's too much foliage and you cannot see anything beyond this But you became camera shy. No. You move out of the picture. Maybe the chair's 
got the view for the camera for the people to see what you were looking at. Be nice, sir. Don't need to be seeing some old man. Oh. Clearing out of the green tunnel. As usual, after a few miles, my ankle hurts badly. I really, somebody finds out what's wrong with my ankle. It's true, I am old, but even so, I still have a few years left I'd like to enjoy hiking without having to stop after five six miles well the good part is at least i am not using a walker so many people at my age are using a walker <laughs> Well, we went to the Queen quite a, on quite a few trails and we see, still didn't see the bald eagles. There used to be a lot of bald eagles. I don't know what happened to them, where they went. So, if I would have to go through all the Michigan trails to find again the bald eagles, so be it. I'm looking for bald eagles. Now, another hill ahead of us. Sandy hill, oh God. Soon we'll be out of the woods. It's almost over with the trail. And again, I didn't meet anyone. We didn't meet anyone on the trail. We all alone. Next time we are going early on the trail. 21 degrees sounds good to me right now. We are almost at 80 degrees. And tonight again we will have freezing temperature. Frost advisory, so. Big difference in temperatures between night and day. And no rain, which 
it's not good because the soil is sandy, doesn't retain humidity, and the dangers of fire are real. And once love this trail. I have to come back on the fall. I was once on the fall on this trail. Of course, I was in Pyrming. Oh my God, it's amazing in the fall, this trail. Even, uh, there are a lot of evergreens and pines, even so, uh, it looks amazing. There are uh, a lot of uh, hardwood trees in the mixtures and the coloring. Okay guys, see you on the next trail. The parking lot is ahead of me.